Beecher Chase, 0 to 160 handicap, 3 mile 2 furlong from Aintree and eights the ground is up the top for Joshua Sutherland. Then we've got Sounds of the Marina, Ashton, Ziva, David, favourite Molly Massini for Go Sappers. Then we've got Spin Flake, Gospels, Peaches, Windy, Miller, Tango, Orange, Eyes to the Right, Passive Future, Coupe de Ville, Black Absolute, Half Supreme. Wonder if he's talking about pizza there, Hollywood. War Pointer, Lucky Money, Eye Catcher, and Winning Racing for Doug Warren Racing. And they're racing, and straight away they're into it. And Joshua's horse did everything it could to dislodge the jockey. He's able to hang on, though. Right down to the second. And I'd say we're actually on the national course here. Up and over the third we go. Oh, and once dislodged the jockey there, it's War P Pointer. So War Pointer is unfortunately out of the race, but luckily there's another horse in it for the stable. And half supreme. What would the other half be? Hawaiian? Unlike most people, I like a bit of pineapple on the pizza. The only problem with pizza is they use the cheapest, nastiest ham that they can find to make the most profit. As they go over the fourth, and as far as I'm concerned, they might as well just sprinkle sea salt all over the pizza. Horrendous. Anyway... Over the fifth we go. Margarita's my favourite. Because it just is. Lots of cheese, bit of tomato, a little bit of basil leaf. And a nice bottle of bubbles to wash it all down. We race down the straight here. We've gone over the water. Oh, this is the water, sorry. We're over it now. I'm going to come down to take this left-hander. And this sorts of the field out a bit as they straighten up here. But no worries for Half Supreme. Leads comfortably by almost two to Spin Flake. Coupe de Ville is third. Molly Massini, Ziva David, eyes to the right. And then we've got Tango Orange, Ashton, Black Absolute, Windy Miller. Gospels, eights the ground, passive future, winning race, peaches, sounds of the marina, eye catcher, and lucky money. And up and over the eighth they go. Out wide on the track here. Oh, once fallen here. Oh, it's Hollywood's horse. Bad luck, Hollywood. Half Supreme's out. And this grey, the widest runner here, is Passive Future. So they come to the third, and up and over they go. And grey Clutterbuck's eyes to the right. It will, he'd want it to keep its eyes straight ahead for these fences. And up and over they, the 11th they go. And Molly Massini for Ghost Sappers is now our new leader. From eyes to the right, Coupe de Ville on the fence with Spin Flake. Windy Miller, up and over the 12th. And at the tail there is uh, Lucky Money. And one's getting pulled up here, and that is Peaches. That's bad luck there for Peaches. They come over Beaches now, and a big jump by the whole field. And it's Molly Massini. Leads them down to Foy and Avon. And up and over. Oh, I walk through Foy and Avon. And another one at the tail there, Lucky Money, is getting pulled out of the race. They come on down to the canal turn. And Smalley Massini will lead them into the canal. And up and over they go. And they straighten up and swing towards Valentine's. And it's Iron Catcher. 
and spin flake together. Molly Massini on the fence up and over Valentine's Day. Oh, another one's crashed out there. It's Windy Miller. I believe that's a Kevin Meanahan horse. Bad luck, Kevin. Still got Tango Orange in the race. They come on down to the 17th and one's fallen there. It's mine. Damn it, Coupe de Ville. So it's uh, Spin Flake in front from 8 to the ground. Who's had a nice race besides the first fence. Then Ashton I catch a Molly Massini. Gospel, Sound of the Marina over the 19th. Then Passive Future, Ziva David, winning race, eyes to the right, and Tango Orange. And it's Black Absolute. Opens up a lead here. It's Black Absolute going nicely. From eights the ground, Ziva David running on. Sort of anyone's race, probably except for mine at the tail there, winning race. They run them towards the second last. And up and over they go on a fast jump by the leader. And Black Absolute's got a handy lead here from Molly Massini at the two and a half. The pack is slowly gaining on this leader as they run on. He's got one more to get over at the two furlong. Jumped it slowly, but he's up and running. Running into second quickly is eights to the ground at the one and a half. There's no more jumping, it's just a grind. That Black Absolute's holding them for now at the furlong from eight to the ground. Molly Massini, Gospels coming out from the pack. So run towards the half. It's Black Absolute in front. Eight to the ground. He's gobbling up the ground. And eight to the ground takes the lead from Black Absolute and Gospel running on him. Eight to the ground wins. And that's a big win there for Josh Sutherland. I wonder if this horse will be he'll be eyeing off for the national. Anyway, H the ground has got up. I'll just wait for the card to pop up. And H the ground wins, of course, for Joshua Sutherland. Second, Black Absolute Alex Cherry. That's a good run, Alex. Third, Gospels Leon Van Rensburg. Fourth was Molly Massini. Ghost Zapper Stable, probably looking towards the national. And the page just zipped up for fifth, and fifth is uh, Passive Future.